Oh my god. Yo, what's up, Archie? Yo, yo. What's up, Cameron? Yo. You guys know each other? Oh, yeah. Yep. Oh, shit. So, uh, I figured, like, I haven't heard from Cameron yet, so you might want to hear this and vice versa. Because you both, pretty much. You guys know that you both got fucked the same way, right? Oh, yeah. Yep. Uh, I'll tell you right now what they did to me the other day. Or yesterday, I should say. So, um, I'm with, you, you know, Slick Rick? Uh, um, I don't think so. He, I mean, he's a lawyer. He just, he just got his bar license. Oh, yeah. Four months, but he just got No, I don't Richards. know. He, uh, uh, he, he's gotten to know Pigeon and stuff very well. Anyways, I was hanging out with him and he's going to a cell rep. So I was going to tag along as, you know, paralegal, or whatever. Just kind of, you know, hang out with him and see what was going on down there. I got in and he was joking around like when we got to the uh uh you know the doors of the uh behind the pd and when we got there he was joking about it, how oh you know i would ruin his or whatever and that he wouldn't let me go with him but he was obviously joking anyways uh was with officer loki and croc i told you about loki before i uh, think you might have i which i've had problems with okay he has, he has a terrible attitude and they do things that are just fucking stupid to people. And Croc as well. Croc was on a spree that day of giving people their felonies for the first time, no matter what, for speeding, for, you know, just he's throwing it at him. So uh, I went in there and then Croc was like uh, questioning me, like, w what says that you're a paralegal? This and this and this and that, even though all Rick has to say is he can come with me. Yeah, and you're as the paralegal, right? Exactly. And I got in the building with Rick, and they're like, "Oh, you know, we." Because Rick wasn't saying anything, he was joking around about me being there. Rock was like, "You need to leave. You need to leave now." He's like, "I'm gonna give you five seconds," and I'm like, "You know, it's obviously a fucking joke," and I'm standing there like in shock, like of how he's treating me. But I'm like, I walk out, and I walk out the building, and I'm standing back there. And he's like, where are you going? You're being detained. I'm giving you felony trespassing. So he cuffs me. He talks with Loki for a second. And I'm just not saying anything at this point. And he brings me to the cell. And he's like, what's going on with you? Why are you doing that? I'm like, I, I literally have no words for him. I literally have no words for him. Hey, is so this Croc or is it Loki? It was both of them. But Croc oh. was the one who, who, who charged me, ultimately. I, Croc is... Croc yeah. is uh, like I think he's in the grand scheme of things. I have a lot of problems with a lot of these cops. I yeah, think yeah. they're like, like a like a shitty Indian customer uh -huh. support line oh, that's yeah. following just like some. Well, he was like, being manual. a dickhead. He was giving. But, yeah, he gave Winslow a felony. He gave everyone a felony that day. So what I, Croc I think is just like a little. He's like extremely paranoid about everything. Mm -hmm. So, but I, I he's a pretty. He seems like a pretty decent dude outside yeah. of that. And being yeah, that's cop, fine. But, but but with Loki, I told you I was dealing with him. Who the fuck attitude. is Loki? Uh, like the other day at the food court, I was with Rick and he made sly comments about how we attempted to do something to someone that was literally just alleged. And yeah. uh, he uh, he was like, oh, I'm going to go tell the DOJ right before Rick got his bar. He's like, I'm going to go tell the DOJ about this so you don't get your bar, you know, just saying like shitty things to him. And I really hated his attitude. I get enough of that from other cops uh, all the time. And so he came down there as I'm talking to Croc about him and he's like, well, you know, say, say what you have to say to my face. And I was like, I absolutely will. And I, I, I told him the things and he was trying to give me excuses and almost like an apology for the way he acts or has acted. I fucking hated that. He's just not, he is, he, he, I, I feel like they forget why they're here sometimes. So, um, yeah, I really don't want to deal with him and, uh, could use your help with that. Oh, you want me to get rid of Loki? Absolutely. Uh, okay. Uh, well, I'll work I'll on, if up. not, I'll work on getting him fired because he is not. And, and after speaking, with I don't think you're officer, getting him fired. No, I don't uh, think and so I'm going to tell you why I yeah. we dealt with this guy named, um, what the fuck was his name, dude? Uh, uh I, his name escapes me. Like literally, I don't know this guy. That's how much he's, well, we've already marked him twice. Um, I can't read chat and use it. 
Oh, but anyway, anything, this dude anything with white up? hair, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. This dude, we're doing like, you know, news and shit. Like me and the boys, literally just doing news, interviewing Slack. Dude comes up to us and starts like saying all kinds of crazy shit. Like pretty much G-checking Chang Gang, which is you're asking for a death wish, right? Like unless yeah. you're stupid. And this guy just kept pressing, pressing, pressing. And eventually we're just like, yo, fuck this. So we found this dude and we murked like eight cops, bro. <laughs> like, Wait, we just... wasn't it? And so... Forte? The one that you... Oh yeah, that's his name, Forte. That you slit the throat of? Oh yes, oh yeah, that's why I hit him again. <laughs> you know why I did that shit? Because I don't actually believe that they did anything to him. Because I called Slacks, right? I'm like, yo, did anything come out of that? And he's like, yo, trust me, something came out of it. And I'm like, not good enough, bro. Because, like, the thing is, I might be a felon and shit like that, but, like, I got the right to know that when a cop, cop be acting up and shit like that, you're going to do something about that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, like mm -hmm. why the fuck it only in Los Santos that, like, I contact the civilian oversight committee that you were part of over and over and over and over again, and that motherfucker don't give a fuck. That, that when, like, I get a cop that's pointing a gun at me, right? Like, when I'm just doing tow trucking, and they're like, oh, she's just having a mental breakdown or something like that. But don't worry, she's still back on the fourth tie shit. And why is it that, you know, these things keep on happening? And then eventually when I do become a felon, now it's the excuses. Well, you a felon, so you don't need to know what's happening. No, motherfucker, I'm still a mem member of the civilians. You know what I'm saying? Like, Absolutely. like, if, if we know that these motherfuckers, like, if, unless they coming through and being like, yo, that dude was acting up. Yeah, sure, it might not be justified by a blaster dude, but if you ain't telling us back that you doing something about it, right? I ain't looking for the guy to get fired. I just want the guy like suspended for a day or something, you know? And if I ain't getting that, then what you want from me? I'm gonna do what I know best, and that's good a motherfucker, bro. <laughs> Absolutely. And that, that's literally how I feel about Loki. I, I'm just being honest with you because he, the fact that he would stare at me in that cell well, I'm about to get a fucking felony for some bullshit. Because that was the warrant, was on right? His mood. What do you mean? Was that the original warrant? No, no. But this no. after the fact. This was after. Yeah. Yeah, and it's like, no, nah, I'm I'm good on that. That's why I'm definitely asking for your help on that. But uh, did anything come out of the Forte situation after the report? Nah, I I, I low key thought like um, they're gonna put a warrant out. You know what I mean? Cause, bro, when I got out of there, there was like a cop SUV and all that. But I got rid of the gun and got picked up another knife. You know what I mean? And uh, nothing yet. But who knows, man? Like, you know? Uh huh. I don't even know and if I he's alive or not. I'm gonna keep it a book. <laughs> so oh, yeah. Uh, and on top of that, just one last thing. I did ammunition uh, yesterday. And I get. Oh my god! I, you went. Dude, they did a motherfucking PD mate did it to you, dude. Yeah. You motherfucking yeah. civilian hey, run for motherfucking mayor, bro. You on the I civilian know. oversight committee, and now you want to do just... motherfucking ammunition, dude? Uh huh. And I shit. did. I did, I did a two. I two man that shit. And I did the hack by myself first try, baby. Oh anyway. shit! All right. <laughs> All right. But uh, I'll say we got uh, we we did the dip. We got out, and I'm wearing I'm wearing my other uh fit. You see me in the red hoodie, the fully blacked out mask, and. Just because my hair's sticking out, I get maple ID'd because him and I look like twins. Like, they're, they're calling me up saying, Are you sure? Are you sure that they're baiting me? Are you sure that wasn't you? Are you sure that wasn't you? Bro, nah. Like, there is no way. If you, if I see a warrant on my head, I told him. What, because your hair was sticking now. out, Tosh? Yeah. Yeah. Bro, yeah. Bro, do everyone a they, motherfucking they, detective, they say, dude? That's crazy. They say, they say, We got the maple clone running. I'm like, Nah. Not a shot that you say that to me. Yo, I don't know where the fuck, like, what the fuck water they be drinking out of, dude. Like, it's crazy, bro. Mm -hmm. You know, you know, you know the wild thing? You know, me and so many people, like, in the Shine game, right? Like, we were planning oh, yeah. all kinds of shit. You know what I mean? And it's like, like, you you talk to one of these motherfucking detectives. Like, I was trying to tell Slacks this. Like, you know what I mean? I'm doing him a motherfucking favor, whether he realize it or not. And that... Uh, I ain't the kind of dude that want to just go make a bill, billion dollar and drive around super cars all day. I'm doing that now, right? Well, why am I doing that? I, my plan like always has been from the beginning. If I'm doing some big shit, I like a little bit of cat and mouse. You catch me, you catch me. You know what I mean? Yeah. But like you go talk to these motherfuckers before you start even saying a sentence, they're already like, 
like their like fucking antennas are up and they're already like you know figuring the entire map out and then it's like well i can't give you nothing because you're gonna figure this shit out yourself anyway you know what uh, i mean i'm gonna wake uh, up to a motherfucking warrant is that uh, my dna uh, was on some like motherfucking like ingredient or like some random shit bro. and it was next to some stills you know what i mean the i fuck? know and uh speaking of supercars hey, I don't know think of the four months the man you got recently but they got three of them oh i saw that what's what is that about where'd they get those um what's so, going on there I, I, from what i was told now take it as like a grain of salt it, uh, they kind of had that on loan or some shit but i don't know if that's true maybe it's in the garage maybe i I don't either a racer told me or a cop told me this. I think it was a cop that told me. I think it might have been it was at Merrill Park with uh motherfucking Cassidy, you know? Because I saw him like roll up in one and start asking him some questions. I think he the one that told me. But nonetheless, um I mean when I see them eight deep in a chase with a, with with one of them driving a supra on yeah. one guy, I'm gonna be like, bro, sh should I just help this guy out at that point? Like I yeah. feel fucking bad. No, nah, you it's ain't ridiculous. Wrong. You ain't wrong, bro. It's fucking ridiculous. Oh, they they get those cars and, and uh, bro, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Nah, I mean, Damn. yeah, you know, I would say, bro, motherfuckers want to stand on your chest and be like, I, you're gonna be screaming, I, I can't breathe, I can't breathe, man. Like, well, it's against my SOPs to let go, dude. That's what's up, bro. They didn't yeah, see anything straight. wrong with that. But yo, hit the thing though. Um, about that, I was watching this like live stream of the races yesterday. That's where those cars were out. I saw some motherfucker in a Challenger, right? And, and you know that shit probably fast as fuck. And instead of chasing these dudes who are just doing a race, I right, motherfucker in this Challenger, the cop car, right? This cop car Challenger was slamming into the dude. Dude was like third place. I think he got pitted at like a hundred. And no, even if it was less God, than a hundred, even if it were less than a hundred, the dude was slamming this challenger was slamming the car into a wall trying to destroy the car and i was just like if i find out who that is i'm a i'm a i'm gonna take his hands i'm a bust no you know what no fuck i'm a i'm gonna take that leg that he used for that accelerator dude i'm a bust mm -hmm. it bro i'm a bust that shit <laughs> hell yeah i know yeah. I need you to do that to Loki. I mean, I got you. Let me, I'll look him up and shit like that. I'll, I'll, I'm gonna keep it bugged, bro. I'm I, so fucking pissed. You give me a, uh, look, I'll get someone to do it. Listen, nowadays, bro, I get motherfuckers to do that shit for me, tight shit. It's actually pretty badass. You know, plus put some money in the, in people pocket that, you know, get into it and they do it right. You know what I'm saying? Is there a message you yeah. want to send? Fuck, I mean. <sighs> I want I, I want him to know that I want, I want something carved in that maybe his attitude will lighten up after that. Or, you know, if he just gone, right. you know, maybe that's for the better. Yeah, you, know? you think about it. You tell me what you want, what, what you want, like a message or you want some shit carved into his like mm -hmm. into his mm -hmm. forehead or some shit like that. I mean, he made me like, the way I mean, I you want a dick on his sound? forehead. I'll get you a dick on his forehead. Tashi, <laughs> you that's, know what I'm saying? You know, that's <laughs> a, honestly, you know what? Fuck it. I mean, might as well. Because Wait. Wait, you want me to put a dick on a forehead, dude? They ain't gonna send no message. He gonna be like, some motherfucking <laughs> pervert just put a fucking dick on my my my, my forehead, bro. Right. That, 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 <laughs> He's already bald, so he can't shave his head. Oh shit! Um, well, that that's a big ass canvas, bro. Fuck, man, you could put a yeah. lot on a motherfucking bald motherfucker, bro. <laughs> I don't know. You can throw a pair of balls on there too. Yo, you know what? I know, he, right? His name's Loki. You might as well. <laughs> You know, I don't know, permanently uh, fucking <laughs> weld some horns on that man's head. Might as well go full out. I don't know. Some shit like that. Let's nah, I'll leave that up to you. I get, but I need to know because, like, he need to know. I hear the thing, right? But yeah. And this is how I do it, and this is the, the way that I think yeah, it is. Because yeah, yeah. you can clap a motherfucker, but they don't do nothing. You know what I mean? You want them to know it was you without it being you. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, you think about that and cook it up true. and you give me a call and you tell me what you want like because I'm telling you bro That guy got you could put the entire like last supper yeah, painting right. on his head if he bowl <laughs> That's what I'm thinking of. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'll cook it up I, uh, a bit. Whatever happens to him, you know if it's a I don't care if it's a disease situation, you know, I, I really care 
I mean, that was special. I'm going to be real with you. I, yeah. I feel bad that's the guy we ran into, Tosh shit. Fucking kick that motherfucker out the plane, Tosh shit. Yeah. Dead and fuck. Damn. I know it. I, I feel like PD it. lost like 10% of their quality that day. Definitely. Definitely. All right, so Cameron, what happened to you? Because, yeah. like, I know you had a warrant just like 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 he did. Just They just threw it out there. Mm -hmm. They didn't bring you in, nothing. You just woke up to one? Yeah, I just woke up to one. Then it fell off three days later, and then I had my gun license for about a week, and then the DOJ took it away. I got another one of those motherfuckers. Yo, before they did. I'm gonna tell you right now, sue them. Like, okay. don't, yeah, like, you can I do. I got slick Rick trying to figure it out. I just don't know what course of action to take. Thugs, I'm not. I don't, yeah, that kind of. I'm kind of intimidated right. by the whole court system. Seems so, everybody's fucked up, and it's just like lawless. It's like Dogtown City Hall. You know what the fuck's going on? <laughs> That, that's a problem dude like you know i you know when i got first got shot up way back i'm still a civilian type shit at the hospital mm -hmm. some dude massacred like 10 people outside the thing i fucking slack some dude they all get on my ass didn't even notice and then that cop died i waited over two months now mind you there was some scheduling issue i was sick and all this right but that only account for a week and a half I don't even put this on the judges because they ain't that many of them, to be honest. But the thing is, right, like two months. I I do not blame the DOJ one bit. These motherfucking cops would be stupid as fuck. They end up dropping the case two days ago after oh, like two months of scheduling. Not even two months, bro. Actually, it was more than two months. They drop it and he's like, they're like, oh, yeah, he's dead now. And, you know, it's taking a while to schedule. Bitch, you tell me that there's six more fucking docket cases right now and that y'all can't monitor six more fucking docket cases and be like, yo, this guy dead. Let's get rid of it. Now they hang that shit over your head, bro. That's a mm -hmm. problem. It's like, so yeah, but I'm expecting to get a little social credit score app on my phone pretty soon here. Kim Jong Max over there. Yeah. Oh, bro. No, don't even get me. I had to get that. Bro, I had to deal with so much wild shit with him. I got drunk as fuck. I don't even remember too much yesterday. You see his face? Oh, I saw, I, I saw some of it. <laughs> no, I ain't seen him for a while. Oh, yeah. He's here. He, he, shit. He got, I was hanging out got, with Bobby Fishing all day yesterday and Gomer he, and fucking. He got, Siobhan, of, so, yeah, he got Siobhan's up. thighs grafted on his face because he was shot so many times and lost that tattoo of his. Yo, that's mm. crazy, bro. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yo. But why'd, let me, you, why'd you get drunk? Bro, I don't even, I don't even know, bro. Like, like, you what know, when you, movie? when you hear a bunch of bullshit, you know what I mean? Uh, the only solution is to get drunk, bro. That's what's up. I, I, I'm surprised I didn't end up in one of those, like, you know, those, like, uh, what's it called? Like opium places. You know what I mean? Where you're just like, yo, this shit's so fucked up. Let me just go like puff some opium or whatever. I For never sure. did that For shit, sure. but I seen that on the, like the, the history channel. You know what I mean? Like mm -hmm. motherfuckers in yeah, the lounge, yeah, you know, yeah, with know, all the bean, like little beanie like chairs or whatever. Like on the ground type shit. They're in the big old hookahs. <laughs> yeah, that, like Sheep Alice in and... Wonderland type shit. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yo, but what I was gonna say, I don't know Karen, what to, Where do I do? What do I? What the right, course of action so do I take? I don't know one? exactly how it works, but I can tell you that some cop, right? And this guy, he's fucking. Like he, listen, bro, I ain't stupid. You know what I mean? Like some of these motherfuckers, like knock on walls type shit. You know what I mean? This dude, every time he sees me, makes a point to be like, "Yo, what up, little tugs." You know what I mean? Like to the point where like I'm about to just shoot him in the face type shit. You know what I mean? Like I'll be like this, yo, what up, little tugs? You know what I mean? Not like, not like, yo, what up, tugs? More like I know it's you no matter how you dress. Is, is that the dude from the shit. parking garage? Oh fuck that. Yeah, that dude, bro. Oh my god. No, bro, that guy got to get like motherfucking deleted off the force type shit. He the one that make him look bad, and I got no problem saying that. This dude, right? Like, uh, just every time he's like, yo, you think I'm stupid or something like that? You think I won't clack back in a way you don't, you're going to regret that shit? You know what I'm saying? Because I'll do it. I'll do it if you want that. But, but here's the thing, right? This dude, I was filming, when, when I was filming at the hospital, there was a judge around. And he was about to get, he was able to get me summoned down to court and do a civil lawsuit. So what you should do, Cameron, is find out who put that shit out, that warrant. And as okay. soon as he around, you contact the judge and you start that case in the city type shit. Then you ain't even got to wait for the docket. 
it's like a cheat code type shit, bro. Okay. And you saw well, I got him. Slick Rick looking into, and I asked him to on the other day. I was told my he might not know this information. He might not know yeah. this. Even my lawyers, and they good. They don't know that, cause like I don't know. Like maybe the shit ain't written down. I don't really know what the deal is. I know it's real because it happened to me. So if they can do it to me, why can't you do it to them? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Very true. Yeah, I don't know. I was I was completely no one no one ever contacted me. No one even hit me up about it. Nothing. I had to hit them up and then they uh yeah, they they said I they they gave me the roundabout that they couldn't release that information, said only a lawyer could get that information about yo, why I have a warrant. Yo, that's that to me don't make no make sense, sense, bro. That didn't make any sense to me. I feel like that's my information. Shouldn't that be public, like a yeah. record for me, a private record for me to access at any point in time? It just feel like there's like, what all if I these... wanted to turn myself in and defend myself and plead not guilty, and then I, shouldn't I be able to not be blindsided yeah. by that? Yeah, that's the thing. You know, it's crazy. It's like, you know, sometimes I go to bed and I'm like dreaming of the shit, and so much of that shit, like just like overlapping type shit, and, and not for any other reason other than there's like singular things that are all kinds of fucked up. Like, it's just like, there's all these gates in place that are just, they're not really gates. They, you can call them gates or you can call them excuses. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, I want to do this. Nah, you can't do that. There's a warrant. Oh, you want to do this? Nah, you need this guy around. Oh, you want to do that? Oh, you got to wait two months. It's like, you know what I mean? It's like all these. Oh, you want to sell weed? You got to be on an app. Yeah. No, nah, I don't mean like that. I mean, with the, with the legal shit, you know what I mean? There's always some barrier that prevent you from being able to defend yourself and then you end up like archie oh bro you got a fucking record you wake up and you're a felon bro <laughs> yeah see i have a completely clean <laughs> oh, record yeah. still too oh That's shit a, yeah there's nothing on you it. know what you know what croc told me while like, I was why, 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 why is my felony? weapons license revoked he's Yo. like a completely clean record he's like you attempted never to, me anything you think he's like you think i was gonna let some paralegal down here with these felonies and attempted murder of government employees on it I said, crack, read it again. So he's like, oh, so yeah, it says accessory. Uh, I try to tell him, like, bro, this is how it happened. Of course he doesn't give a fuck, crack. But still, it's the fact that he be even oh, bring it up to me. Crack. Yeah, bro, I thought I was about? thinking coyote, though. I don't nah. know. They like animals, you know what I mean? Like no, 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 the no, motherfucking no, the, coyote, the crocodile, like fucking no, the design, angry They're like Aussie. a fucking, probably a dog, like, you know. Officer dog or yeah. some shit. No, They're no, probably not, like not a poodle and shit like that. No, no oh croc. yeah, I don't We're know who the fuck croc is. That's my bad. Yeah, angry Australian. Angry. Angry. Oh, oh shit. Petty as fuck too. Extremely Kinda, petty. Yeah, definitely like come on. I mean <laughs> uh, if you don't know I, this guy I, who's Croc bro. He's bro. All day. Oh. You know Winslow? I doesn't know Croc. He gave nah. him his first felony over a fucking uh traffic uh speeding. Like, Officer Clifford uh, the dog <laughs> is crazy. Like, no remorse. Yo. Oh shit, bro. Wait, yo, you come across any pieces? I'm buying like as many as you can get. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm I'm ready right. to fund a motherfucking what? arsenal tie shit. Are you are you are you gonna just are you taking uh 1911s or are you gonna take locks too? Because we just hit that ammunition. I mean, I'll take some, but the problem with that is like the magazines and shit are harder to come by unless you can get your hands on those. Like if you're going to guarantee an ammo purchase, I'll get you a bunch of fucking ammo tugs. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well, uh, we're about to hit our crate too today or tomorrow. We'll oh, something shit. Out and I'm still waiting on my three contacts for normal. Right. And yeah, you know, I'm going to hit you up first. Yeah. Yeah. Bro. I'm looking to like, there's some shit I want to work on, right? Like I, I can't. I don't like to sit on my hands, you know what I mean? And I got mm -hmm. some shit pumping right now with like shine and shit like that. When I mean, you saw my wit, I just pay four hundred thousand, my shit going clean, whatever. Even if I get locked up, like I got money paid for that. You know, I'm going knees deep in and right now I want to start some shit with guns, you know what I'm saying? Like stack up on that shit, rotate it, all that. So you come across it, I'm dead I'm like guaranteed I'm gonna give you cash for that. So I'll sell okay, you one if you pay for the last one. Wait, did I not pay you? No, but I yeah, I got you. I got you. That's you guys my bad. Were knee deep. Yeah. Oh, you guys were knee deep. Oh fuck, you right when yeah, shit was popping yeah. off. Mm -hmm. 
Bro, I be waking up to that shit all the time. You don't even know, bro. Like, I'll get a call. It's oh, like, I was... yo, we just did terrorism, by the way. And I'm like, all right, okay. <laughs> like, I ain't don't even phase me no more, Ty shit. <laughs> just the other, uh, what am I saying? Like, uh, oh, Tar's calling me. He's helping me out with shit. But, uh, <laughs> like an hour or so ago, I heard a bunch of gunshots in Mirror Park. I'm at my house. Yeah. There's a lot of guns there, apparently. I think it's a hydra to some shit. Yeah, now nah, um, we were doing some, like, we were at, like, yeah. we, we had a one hour war just now with them. Uh, let me see. Yeah. Yo, yo, I'm yeah, with I woke up to right uh, <laughs> ESB apparently okay. being awake and robbing sanitation. Wait, ESB? What so, you mean? Yeah, yeah, the East Side Ballers decided to wake up out down there in Grove. Damn, they might want to reconsider yeah. their branding, bro. That, 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 yeah, 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 I yeah. heard some, I heard some shit about them. I don't really know too much yeah. of that, but their name still hit the street. People hear ESB, mm -hmm. they ain't, they look the other way, bro. Yeah, they, they, yeah, they. <laughs> Yeah, but they no, might know not know any better. Static you know, it might be us. Fresh cat. Yeah, might be some static between KTB and ESB. We'll see how it rolls, though. Oh yeah, I, I don't even really get my hands dirty anymore. I just pay guys too, honestly, Tugs. Yeah, I feel that. That's the best way to do it. Damn, fucking motherfucking games just waiting up like that. Yeah, yeah, and then they were robbing Sandy, yelling KTB, trying to false flag like they us. Wait. Mhm. Mm oh shit! I didn't know you were yeah. KTB. I was wondering yeah, about I the purple KTB show. with Andre. Yeah, oh, I founded that shit with him. Shut up. Wait, for real? Yeah. Wait, for how long? Yeah. I'm in the shadows, though, bro. As soon oh. as the inception came, me and me and Andre started that shit together. Oh, that's I've taken crazy. a step back. He's, he's yeah. more of the face, and I just, I'm on business side. Like, I'm running business with, with Tommy Cuso, and I got the warehouse rolling. Dex woke up. He's going to yeah. become a fucking, he's starting a church. Fucking Dex Martin, Father Dex Martin. Damn. And, crazy yeah crazy shit been popping off honestly but uh yeah it's been been just keeping low key i mean i fuck is. with that dude i fuck with that vibe you know just don't you know throw the wrong thing in the wrong place because next thing you know they're gonna be like raiding your shit you're gonna wake up your shit raided yeah. like what the fuck happened yep. it's like oh yo you'll find with your dna on a napkin or some shit like that you know what yeah I mean? yeah <laughs> exactly well yeah. all these are legitimate businesses Let's yeah. start a little tobacco shop plays tobacco oh shit i Yep. I uh, kind of like helped Burgers by O'Shawn get off the ground. Donated a bunch of money and stuff. I work for them also. Oh, so shit. I got a few different I... ways. I'm going to be cleaning money, laundering later no, down I the lines. Fuck with that, dude. All right. Well, shit, boy. Y'all well, yeah, you know, need anything. You, you, give, the shadows. you let me know. Right now, my only thing is I need guns. I'm going to get your thing sorted. Archie, as soon as you okay. tell me what kind of message you're going to send, because that's my vibe, right? Like, I can gun a motherfucker now, but like, gotta leave something you know what i mean be better than them is the yeah, way i look yeah, at no, it he just fuck man i i'm gonna i'm gonna cook something up for him but he he definitely he deserves it i mean even that uh backhanded uh excuse apology he was trying to make to me about how he yeah. acts in the cells i that does not fly with me that would not fly with you either ain't no uh, way no nah, hell no i mean like, let, oh let... you know i was just acting the way i did like don't even give me that just send me to jail yeah i <laughs> said well, send me to jail well, you know, I got something for you. That dude who put out the warrant that fuck you up. If yeah. you want, I can put out a hit on him too. We'll oh, print fuck, out yeah. the motherfucking warrant, right? And we mm -hmm. fucking nail that shit to his head. That's that. That. that yo, yo, that dude. I want it, bruh. Wait, nail I want to do the, that to the guy that sent me a warrant too. Yeah. How do I find out who set it up? Uh, talk to your lawyer. Your lawyer should be able to tell you. Yo, like slick Rick's bro, I got you, bro. Brochy. We'll get the okay. motherfucking warrant printed lawyer. out. We'll nail that shit to the head tie shit, bro. <laughs> this guy, man, he didn't give me no information. I just offered him cash right on the spot. Too. Yo, that's day. so fucked. It's great. Dedicated. Yeah. A yeah, dedicated lawyer. Yeah, yeah. Not a mistake. Think about Roman Atlas. Uh, I'm going to keep it real, dude. I don't really know. Like, I, I fuck with Tony right now. But, uh. All right. Yeah, the best it's, lawyers it's, are Tony and Robin. Tony and Robin, yeah. And, yeah. yeah. Okay. Because they represented you guys too, and you know Robin uh, puts in the work. He goes hard in the paint. Yeah, um, I um, I'm gonna be real. I didn't see Robin in action too much because I was like, oh, yeah. dealing with like getting my he, motherfucking. He's old as fuck, so he knows a lot of shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh shit. He's, right. he's seventy two. He's seventy two. But uh, uh, I would say Uriel, but he kind of the opposition. Nah, 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 yeah, he's listen, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. That dude, mm -mm. I mean, it's not even that he an op, 
is I'm talking, he's doing some like, I don't even know how he's still a lawyer type shit. I trust me. I know some things. I know how, because he under the wing of a miss Javon and a Mr. Maximilian. Yeah. I mean, they yeah. be working hand in hand. Like, I don't, bro. It's like, you know, what? they like back in the day, the motherfucking like Romans and shit like that. Everybody used to like do that in Sesame shit. He in that <laughs> dog, he in that pile, bro. He in that pile. You don't even know what, what's going yeah. on at that point. You know what I mean? It's just like, like a bunch of fucking, like if you were to draw some lines, like one little like diagram, it's just a bunch of like scribbles and shit. It that jumbled up. <laughs> I don't even know what Tug says half the time, bro. All right. All right. Oh, she would have just kept running for mayor, Archie. And the company ain't even nothing no more, man. Well, I wish uh, Tugs would have at least beat Solomon and Michael. Yeah, but it I see. Been nicer. I, I mean, bro, like, I listen, you. Archie, you saw me, bro. I came in, like, just pissed off to make a point. I didn't even think I, I was going to get that kind of wave. You know what I mean? If I knew better, I would have started a week before, you know? Yeah. You you made so much leeway, Tugs. Think about how much you did. Yeah, fucking two days of campaign, bro. And and plus I got that in that fucking old motherfucker's head, bro. Every time you see me, you're like fourth place. I'm like, bro. I know I fucked you up. I saw the way you were acting, bro. No, you can't hide. You can't hide your emotions, bro. Like, <laughs> I Wait, had who, that dude press. Oh, Frank? mass dude. Oh, oh man, bro, man, man. I got him wicked press. I think I, I shattered him a fucking image of himself type shit. So, but you know, when song singing about running for mayor, when, when you pulled up, when he was giving that one last town hall speech to the public and you yeah. were there with your kid, that was the funniest thing ever. You bitched him. <laughs> yeah. You know, the funny thing about it all, it like heart to God type shit, you know, um, it was. Like, I think he's too stupid to understand that the reason I went as hard as I did with him is because the next runner up got to look like the strong opposition. Otherwise, you don't get the number two vote, bro. That like, I don't like everybody know that. <laughs> she. Uh, did, oh, I, did I tell you I found out who they sent to put that PD Glock on me in HVAC parts? No, nah, what happened? There. Uh, Reed Dankleaf. You know, Reed? <laughs> Wait, why was he fucking with you? They, well, when I was running, I, you know, I told you they tried to get me out of the race with a felony. So they sent these guys to put a, you know, a PD Glock and HVAC parts on me. And, uh, they were like, if you don't drop out by Monday, this is going to show up to the police. It was fucking Reed. Reed admitted to me when I, I picked him up at the hospital and gave him oh, a ride from the nah. cops. Uh, and so I'm trying to think who's close to Reed and them in, in McConnell. I don't know. I know they go up north. It's Reed, oh, I'm, I'm, then the Diamond Dogs. It's Reed. I, I just, because I just got a ride. Is that Michael? From, yeah, Michael. Fuck, bro. Yeah. I know he did it. I knew that guy did that to me. Nah. Because he never talks to me. He always bats an eye. He bats an eye then. I mean, Max even talks to me more than him. I mean, he sent that motherfucker out to get me a, a felony so I'd lose because he was so scared of his position that I knew he was going to lose anyway because he didn't do shit. Nah, nah. And, oh, by the way, I'm sorry, just to vent. We did nah, not nah, need do him it. for fishing. We did not need that. I, I keep going around telling people, hey, we didn't need Michael Simone for fishing. Oh, nah. <laughs> no, that's crazy. That's crazy. Oh, and I'm dogging on bones. You know too. what? We should get Solomon to tweet up. out. You're welcome, guys. I brought it. I didn't have a I chance. I brought it. Yo. <laughs> Yo. That's what that, that was the only thing that motherfucker was running on. Oh, Damn. God, bro. And, Damn. and I'm like, and I'm, I'm also dogging on bones too a little bit. I'm saying I don't feel sick because, we, you know, we got pirates going around on the Alamo Sea. Robbing yeah. all the fishermen yeah. with guns. So I'm like, I don't feel safe in Sheriff Bones Sandy Shores. The Bone Zone is dangerous. Oh, yo, I that is I crazy, bro. I love bro. messing with them. All right. But look, I got to get going. Yo, camera, I'll catch you around, yeah? Archie, let me know, all right? Yo, Once you get that you message, you, you let know me know. I'll get it sorted, bro. No, no, absolutely. You the man, all right? Yeah, yeah. Let me know if you need anything in the meanwhile. I'm working on those guns. Hell yeah. Yo, this spot is fire, but I guarantee someone's going to have a camera here one day. Me up later, Tug. Yeah, yeah, we'll do. I'll be around tomorrow. I don't know how long I'm gonna run around today, but tomorrow, you know, for a couple hours, eight hours probably. 